Osun, what was the most pleasant and unexpected change that you were not expecting from fat loss? What I was not, what I was not expecting was the, the impact that it would have on all the other aspects of my life. You know, it's sorry, like when I, when I read your question just now, I feel like I got like not to be all like mushy or whatever, but I, I did like I almost like it was so weird. Wow. I almost got hit like, you know, like I just had an emotional thought, like just really like just thinking about just thinking about like what all this has done for me. Like, I mean, if you would have looked at my life like 10 years ago, where I was at physically, my relationships, my career, and if you would have asked me, or if someone would have told me that, hey, look, did you know in 10 years from now, you are gonna be looking nice and lean and be very healthy, and you're gonna have three beautiful children that are eating quality food, growing up around exercise, that you're gonna own your own home, that you're gonna be very established in your career, you know, you're gonna have a beautiful, a beautiful and amazing, you know, wife. Uh, that you'd be doing something like streaming and like, you know, helping inspire and motivate others. You know that you would be, that you would be uh, doing things to help you know secure yourself financially, becoming more, becoming more financially literate. That you would be doing other things within the realm of fitness swimming, biking, pull-ups, Olympic lifting. I would have said fuck no. Hell no. You're you're dude, not me. Not me. That ship sailed. Like hell no. And so I would say that was probably the most pleasant and unexpected thing that when you start taking care of yourself which in my opinion is a form of respecting yourself. When you start respecting yourself, you start taking care of your body and you start saying that you are worthy of good quality food, of physical activity. You are worthy to not have health problems. You are worthy to live a very, you know, health, you know, healthy and fit life. Dude, that empowers you, builds confidence, and you just start thinking like, well, fuck. If I can do this, hell yeah, I can have a great career. And you start, and you just start, you just start killing it. You're like, you know what I mean? If I can fucking lose 100 pounds, well, you know what? I can fucking climb the ladder and I can, and I, and, 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 and I can do the career. You know what? I can have great relationships because now I'm in alignment with my values and what I want, and I will find other people that respect that and have and, and, and are similar. You know what I'm saying? You know what? Yeah, I'm gonna start killing it financially. I'm gonna start saving money. I'm gonna start thinking about my future. You know what I'm saying? So like, it really does, and I think it starts there, man, because like, you're just more motivated, you're more inspired, you have more energy. I mean, it's just, it truly was and is a blessing, you know, and not that I'm a super religious person by any means, um, but it truly was just, you know, it truly was. I mean, I don't know where I would be if I was, if I had not changed, you know, if I had not had that moment of clarity in 2012, you know what I'm saying? So hopefully that, uh, hopefully that answered your question. And sorry for getting a little, a little, uh, little whatever, emotional or whatever. But like, it just really, and, and it's why, it's why I want to help others. 
Because I want others to experience that same fucking feeling. Because you can. You know what I mean? Like, that, that for me is what it's all about. Um, okay. 